This morning in our Bible Minute Fact Talk, I would like to touch on one of the great signs of the end times. In 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 1 to 3, the Apostle Paul predicted that a time would come when men and women would turn away from the Christian faith, once for all delivered to the saints, Jude 1 verse 3. Paul writes in 2 Thessalonians concerning the coming of the Lord Jesus and our being gathered to him, we ask you, brothers, not to become easily unsettled or alarmed by some prophecy, report or letter supposed to have come from us, saying that the day of the Lord had already come. Don't let anyone deceive you in any way, for that day will not come until what? Rebellion occurs. Now the Apostle Paul is saying there that before the return of Jesus and the coming of the Antichrist, the one world leader, the 666, there would be a rebellion, a turning away from the Christian faith across the world, a departing from it. The Greek word is apostasia, from where we get the English word apostasy. It means defection from the truth. Robert L. Thomas, writing in the Expositor's Bible Commentary, explains that the word apostasia means a deliberate abandonment of a former professed position. A deliberate abandonment of a former professed position. In 1 Timothy 4, verse 1 to 4, the Apostle Paul adds these additional details on the time. He says, Now the Spirit clearly says that in the latter times some will depart from the faith, giving heed to deceiving spirits and doctrines of demons, speaking lies and hypocrisy, having their own consciences seared with a hot iron. For the time will come when men will not put up with sound doctrine. Instead, to suit their own desires, they will gather around them a great number of teachers to say what their itching ears want to hear. Well, they will turn their ears away from the truth and turn aside to myths. Wow. Now, one of those verses portray is that as the world moves towards the return of Christ, there will be firstly a rise in false teachers who will follow or be led by spirits instead of God's word. And evil teachings instead of the truths of scripture, wrong theology. They'll be hypocritical in character, liars without a true godly heart. Beware of such teachers. And secondly, because false teachers do not exist in a vacuum, in the latter days, many who call themselves Christians will follow their own sinful desires, not godly desires or scripture. Instead, dispensing with God's word, they will go for teachers who will say what their itching ears want to hear, rather than what God is saying in scripture. And all this will occur as the vast majority of the population rejects Christian values, a Christian worldview of the things of God. Would you say, we have entered the apostasy. It's some, something to think about in the light of world events, isn't it? May God bless you as you don't give up on your love for the Bible.